Hi everyone, Bruce from Snare here, and welcome to the video. Today I want to talk about Snare E3 and how it can enable, extend, and enrich your log collection capabilities. So what is Snare E3? E3 is Snare's ability to enable, extend, and enrich your security posture. Whether it be covering additional log collection use cases, enriching log data, or providing the forensic capability to empower security analysts in the event of an attack. This short video will highlight how Snare E3 can be leveraged within IBM Q Radar, reducing MTTR and enabling security professionals to react quicker. So let's take a look at this in action. Firstly, we recommend that all Snare customers who also use Q Radar download the E3 content pack from the IBM App Exchange. The content pack itself contains DSMs and extensions that enable detailed passing of Snare log data from our Windows, Linux, and MSSQL agents. It also includes eight Pulse dashboards to easily surface log data and provide empowering visualizations of activity within your infrastructure. Let's take a look at these dashboards populated with Snare data. The first Pulse dashboard we're going to review is the Snare DAM dashboard. This dashboard works in combination with our MSSQL DSM and surfaces some higher level information regarding the activity of our MSSQL instance. As you can see, I have the number of events per database, the total number of events per event type, and the total number of events per user. This provides us with a good indication of the events being generated by our MSSQL instance. It allows us to build up a baseline of expected activity over time meaning any new anomalies can be detected easier. The DNS Analytics Dashboard works in combination with Sysmon, collecting DNS events locally on the endpoint and providing enhanced, forensically valuable information. Utilizing the data in these logs, we get a holistic view of the DNS events happening across our estate. We can also use this dashboard to perform simple searches. By specifying some text in the DNS query parameter, we can very quickly check if a particular DNS lookup has occurred across our infrastructure. The Snare Data Enrichment Dashboard allows us to visualize the total event traffic being generated by our custom enrichment rules. In this particular scenario, log data is being enriched at an agent level with its business unit. This log data is then aggregated in each region by a Snare Central, where it is again enriched before being sent to QRadar. As you can see, I can interact with the charts to get an understanding of the total log volumes per region, as well as further by business unit. This is just one use case, but the flexibility of SNES log enrichment means it has many other applications. The file and registry access monitoring dashboards provide high level information about the users and processes accessing highly sensitive information. We can see information such as what files have been accessed, what files had failed access attempts, and a detailed table showing all the required information, such as the system generating the log, the user accessing the files, and the level of access that was requested. The File and Registry Integrity Dashboard provides a high-level overview of modifications to highly sensitive information. We can see information such as the number of events per file, the type of modification, whether that is a new file being created, a file being deleted, or a file being modified, as well as a table containing detailed event data, such as the date time of the event, the system, the particular file or registry being changed, the type of event, hashes of the data before and after, and information about object attributes, ownership, and size. The Snare USB dashboard shows a high-level overview of the USB capabilities of Snare agents. The agent can be configured to generate events when a USB or device has been attached or detached from the system. This dashboard shows us information such as how many events have occurred per device type, the number of attached and detached events per system, and a table containing important details such as the system the events occurred on, the timestamp, the device type, and the identifier of the device itself. The final dashboard is the Snare Time Series Dashboard. This dashboard provides baseline charts for all extended logging capabilities in Snare E3. Using this dashboard, we can build up a picture of events being generated on a day-to-day -day basis. 
Any large spikes will provide an immediate point of escalation to ensure no malicious activity is occurring within your network. If you would like any further information regarding Snare E3 or any of our other products, please visit our website. Thank you for watching.